Hey, hello. Hey, it's Joshua Vergara from Android Authority. What's going on, everybody? Now, today we're going to take a look at something a little bit different. Now, we love our Android phones and tablets, but there are times when we have to travel, even if it's a small commute to work or you're going to a place overseas, and you need to be able to store your devices in a safe place. Also, when you're traveling or commuting, sometimes you run out of power. Well, when those situations arise, Timbuktu has the answer for both of those situations, and it's called the Power Commute Bag. Now, what makes this bag special is that it comes with a power brick called the Joey T1 included inside, which allows you to charge your devices on the go in a very easy way. We're going to take a look at that, and this is a bag that I brought with me to CES, and the entire Android Authority team that went to CES absolutely fell in love with the bag. So, what's a good way to review a bag that has the word commute in its name? Obviously, we're going to commute. So, this is the Timbuktu Power Commute. Let's go. some coffee. Uh, no. All right, let's do this. All right, so as you saw in the video earlier, uh, there's a little white cord coming out from the bag going into what was my Samsung Galaxy Nexus right here. And now that's one of the great features about this bag is that there happens to be a power brick installed at the other end of this cord, and I'll show you that in a little bit. But as you can see, this is a Timbuktu bag. It's a messenger bag. It goes around your shoulder. And what happens is you're supposed to be able to carry pretty much everything that you need inside of this one bag and that is illustrated by the fact that at the back here there's a whole new compartment for a bunch of different electronics. Uh, in this case I brought my Nexus 10. However, uh, one of the, the other great thing about it is since this flap comes out, it is TSA compliant, meaning that when you have your laptop in here, which is supposed to hold a 15 inch MacBook, uh, which means that a lot of 15 inch PCs won't be able to fit in here. But if you have a compatible laptop, it'll go through here and it becomes TSA compliant, meaning that when you go to the airport, you just take this flap, you bring it down and it'll go through the scanners just fine. You don't have to take your, bat, your laptop rather out of the bag and put it in its own tray. So that's a really great feature of this. Otherwise, you have room over here for a couple other different devices like two tablets, which is what I usually use. The Nexus 10 is right here and the Nexus 7 is usually over here. Uh, and then when you zip it all up, it's able to store those, but still have a lot of room on the inside. And that would be enough room for various different inserts. Like for me, since I'm a videographer, a photographer and whatnot, what I usually have inside here is my camera insert. This camera insert is able to fit in there. And as you can see, it has all of my camera equipment inside. <clears throat> so I'll put that aside over here. Otherwise, as you can see, there are a lot of different pockets inside. We have even this little flap on the back, which doubles as a laptop insert when the one in the back just doesn't seem to work. I happen to use this insert quite a lot with my laptop because it's kind of a behemoth at even just 15 inches. It's really thick, but still fits back here even with the camera insert inside. Otherwise, you have a couple pockets over here, one pouch in the middle, and on the front right here, you have two pockets for different cell phones if you want to use that for that or anything else. Another great thing is there's this pocket on the side right here that zips out and opens up. One great thing about that pocket is, again, this is called the power commute. It helps you while you're on your commute so you don't have to open up your bag to reach certain things. For example, if I'm holding it like a suitcase, I'll be able to go into the pocket right here, zip it down, and I'll be able to reach in and grab whatever I need. The last thing about this would be the power brick that's inside. And that would be here at the right pocket of the Timbuktu bag. 
This is called the Joey T1. And the reason why it's called the Joey is because it has a very unique feature. It doesn't come with its own charger. What you need to do is, here's the cord for charging whatever device you connect it into. However, right here, there's another port that is the micro USB port, and that's used by any charger that you have already available for your phone. See, what the Joey does is it piggybacks off of the charger that's already included with your phone, so it charges using that, but while you're charging your power brick, you should be able to use the charging port already there to also charge your phone at the exact same time. So that's the reason why it's called the Joey. And uh, the Joey is supposed to be able to do about two and a half charges for a cell phone and maybe about one to maybe three quarters of a charge for a, t for a full size tablet. So you kind of have to pick your poison there. However, the Joey is a great way to charge your devices on the go and it's a great tool to have when you're on those commutes and you just happen to run out of a little bit of, ba uh, a little bit of power. This is just a quick overview of the Timbuktu Power Commute Bag. And so, there you have it. Another long day at work, and finally, home sweet home. The Timbuktu Power Commute Bag is available at Timbuktu.com for the price of $199.99. That might be a bit of a hefty price for some people, but trust me, if you felt like this is the bag for you, that price is more than worth it. Timbuktu has a lifetime warranty on all of their products, and for good reason. They're pretty confident that their products will last a lifetime, and in my experience, They've certainly lived up to that expectation. Also, any Android phone, phablet, or tablet that you might possibly have will feel at home inside of here. And the Joey T1 power brick will ensure that your devices never go without power ever again. Unfortunately, however, it does come in just this color. And while I like it, some people may not really enjoy the gunmetal gray and green that this bag only comes in. I'm pretty sure though that Timbuktu will come out with more colors in the future. However, like I said, Timbuktu.com for the Power Commute Bag. I hope you enjoyed this review. And remember, we always have videos up on the Android Authority YouTube page, so remember to subscribe by clicking this link right here. All right, so that's all from me, Joshua Vigar at Android Authority. Remember to go to AndroidAuthority.com for all of your Android news because it is your source for all things Android. Hey, <laughs> give my picture right here. I made it. I made it. I was gonna say that. him. Which one? So you said him. When? You Twice. Did. I heard it too. When you're talking. When you're talking. When you go, you said him. Really? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Oh. I'm I'm doing it now, so I don't have to do it later.